Good morning. One of the things that I find as I visit people in the hospital and other places is we all want a sense of peace. But most of us find that state of being difficult to achieve. How do I achieve peace in my own life? I am here to tell you that I believe that peace is a gift from God, that it is a normative, a normal human condition. Most of us don't experience peace. Why? If it is, in fact, how we're supposed to be, why don't more of us walk around feeling peaceful? I believe peace is an unconditional gift from our Creator. But our reception of that peace, well, that's a different story. The Buddhists, for example, talk about lives filled with distraction, things that pull us away from being centered. Uh, I happen to think the Buddhists are right about that. I also happen to believe that we live in a culture that is designed to keep us distracted. Whether it's a new car to restore our sexiness as we age, or um, a basketball team or a football team to stir our passions or keep us interested when we're bored. Uh, we spend a great deal of money in this country and throughout the world in order to provide ourselves with distraction. Peace, though, peace is not distraction. Peace is something that we can get in touch with when we learn to be still. The Buddhists call it acquiring a seat, the ability to sit down for 40 minutes and concentrate your thoughts on the present, uh, seeking an internal stillness. The Bible speaks of God as at times that still small voice. Well, the voice of God will give you peace, but you've got to be able to hear it. And I will tell you with the cacophony of sound that we surround ourselves with, we seldom have enough silence in our lives to hear God and to experience peace. So what I want to say to you this morning is acquire a practice, acquire a seat. Find some way to meditate, whether it's in your garden or in a swimming pool or sitting in your kitchen in silence. Shut off the stereo, shut off the phone, shut off the computer and get still and see what God has in store for you.